Hey there guys, what is up? Hope you're having a great day. Thanks uh, for joining me here on Five Star Cars. Uh, my name is Shane and uh, yeah, thanks for clicking on the channel and taking a few minutes out of your day to check out what's going on here. Um, so today uh, we're gonna be covering basically Shmi 150 in Supercars of London. Um, if you're new to the channel, I would love it if you would smash the subscribe button and if you want to follow my own personal account or the channel's account on Instagram and uh, get involved. Uh, comment below guys where you're from, what's your favorite channel, who's, what's your favorite car, anything like that. I'll bring up your uh, comments in my videos. Um, I'm trying to make this channel a kind of like a podcast to chat about your favorite car YouTubers and anything to do with project cars, supercars. JDM cars, ain't new cars. I'm a car nut like E, and I love watching, you know, the likes of, you know, DV, Tavarish, Shmi 150, all those channels, and I'm trying to use this to learn myself more about supercars and and to make this channel grow, um, you know, and turn into something a bit different that other YouTubers, uh, car YouTubers, haven't done. Um, I think what I'm going to do with this channel, and the reason why you should subscribe, is. I'm going to show you when we get monetized the paycheck every month you're going to see how much this channel makes and you're going to see it grow and you're going to decide what i do with that paycheck every month so whether i'm making a hundred dollars five hundred dollars or euros or ten thousand euros you're going to tell me what to do with that money what project car i should buy what wheels i should buy body kit all that kind of stuff so if that's what you're looking for in a channel um, you know this is the place for you help the channel grow and get it where it should be so i can give you the content that you want and uh, you know you'll see me go on my travels wherever I end up going if I end up um, you know collabing with other YouTubers if I ever get that big to do that so I'm just making this a fun channel for you guys and just us, us to chat about anything to do with supercars as well um, also guys I've made a website that come up here where you can vote for your 2019 car YouTuber of the year I'm going to release the results at the end of this month and then I'm thinking of making a forum for the website where you can make trades and chat about what's going on in the supercar community on YouTube as well I think that would be pretty cool um oh and also in around four weeks time i'm going to dubai i cannot wait uh to for a week uh just for a holiday for myself go over a relax party and just uh basically check out as much supercar as i can so you know i'll bring you along for the ride just see me get up to dublin get the flight get over there and i'll vlog as much supercar content as i can i'm new to the whole youtube thing so you know i'm gonna try my best and saying that i'm thinking of getting a gimbal this week there's a cars and Caf coffee on in limerick so i'm gonna vlog that for you get you whatever i can out of that as well so that'll be my first vlog this weekend and uh, hopefully you like it uh so without me rambling on too much anyway oh one more thing i have i think what i'll do is when we get monetized we're not gonna be too far off it um you know i'll give away this lamborghini led sign or ferrari one you get to pick the color and wherever you are in the world i'll send it on to you and as the channel gets bigger the giveaways will get bigger so that's the whole lot of everything that's going on with the channel uh if you're new thank you for watching so far we're going to jump into today's video uh so in today's video we are going to be covering shmi 150 uh he basically covers the new pagani imola uh imola at uh, five million dollar supercar hypercar it's a mental look of thing um so he did that and also we're covering uh paul from supercars of london uh he covered the lamborghini onyx aventador sx so there are the two for today i'm just trying to think of any honorable mentions um it looks like oh yeah park from uh, vehicle versions is going to vegas it looks like he's moving i've been watching his stories i it looks like he has a lot of plans in the pipe works uh what he's going to do um so i've seen that uh in the hands i've seen today oh i saw daily driven exotics uh in the drager in their friends mental looking things so i might make a video for that tomorrow as well uh so check the so subscribe to see that uh so let's get on with the video um so shmi 150 he covered the pagani Imoya. um what can i say about this car five million dollars absolutely insane um he couldn't say no to not covering it i wouldn't blame him you know his friend it's a friend of a friend that took it out and went for a spin it it sounds absolutely insane uh shmi always gets to cover the best cars that's why his channel is so good because he's just like the best guy ever to know um for supercar content and his knowledge in cars is insane um you know i really enjoy his channel uh, you know, and so in saying that, it's just here's one or two clips of him checking out this insane beast of a thing. 
Look at this thing. Feast your eyes over the car that is in front of us, now parked under the streetlights. Darkness has just fallen, but I could not turn down an opportunity to take a look at this spectacular thing. The newest model from Pagani, their most powerful car ever as well. And in my mind, this is the spiritual successor to the Zonda Cinque. It goes. Wow. You can see a lot more of the, uh, the detail and the color scheme. Was the red and gold on the wing, also the red calipers with the gold wheels. Oh, I probably wouldn't do that in here. I think that might hurt our ears. <laughs> oh no, oh no. Okay. So yeah guys, what do you think? Uh, did you watch the video? Uh, what do you think of the car? If you had five million dollars to spend, would you get that car? I mean, I suppose if you have the money, you couldn't say no. I think they're only making five of them, so you know, it's just carbon fiber all over. Uh, it sounds insane. Uh, the wheels look really nice in it. I love the, the Italian stripes on it as well. Uh, it's, the, the, the rear diffuser on it is just mental. I would be so scared driving that car, really, like, it, it's so epic, but in saying that, it's, it's a head turner, to say the least. Um, but it was a really good video. I, I enjoyed watching it. Tim does get access to some of the best cars in the world, you know. Um, so, yeah, would let me know what you thought of the video. And you follow Stream 150. Um, you know, what would be your favorite car of his fleet? For me, it's the 675 LT. I, I love that car, even though the Senna and GT40 are pretty up there as well. Uh, so, yeah, I'm going to rate that video out of 10. It was a pretty epic video. So, I'm going to give it an 8.5 out of 10, which I think is a, a fair rating. So, on to number two, uh, Paul from Supercars of London. Uh, he has covered the Lamborghini Onyx Aventador SX. Um, I, I don't really watch him that much. Uh, it's a pity he's only going back to, I think he's just doing one video a week. For a guy that has like over 800,000 subscribers, I would be, you know, he has a great chance to make this into, a, like, if I had that platform, to, to be able to make that kind of content and that kind of uh, a subscriber base, I just don't understand why he isn't near even posting every day. Um, he's got the cars to do it. I know the weather in the UK isn't great. I'm in Ireland, so, you know, I know what it's like, but, I just, I, I read the comments and people are not happy, like they're very not happy with the content he made with this uh, Lamborghini, um, you know, having a football freestyler with it. And I watched it and I was really bored pretty quickly within a few minutes into the video. Um, the car looks amazing. So I'm gonna show you a quick clip of the car itself. Uh, so check this out. So yeah guys, it's a beautiful car, love it, it absolutely is epic, but it looks like the video was rushed, um, it's, the editing isn't great in it, if you haven't seen the video you can watch it, but check out the comments what people are saying, um, a lot of people that follow this channel wanted to go back creating better content, and it looks like he's it's starting to go downhill and he shouldn't be doing that, I don't know what he's up to himself, but he, I hope he gets back into making more content a bit better and, and, and doing what he does with supercars. Um, it wasn't a great video to be honest with you. I'd probably give it a, you know, for the car being there, uh, just the car alone, six and a half out of 10. So, you know, hopefully Paul will get back at it. I mean, if I had access like that, which I don't, you know, I'd be vlogging and just driving around in my cars all the time. <laughs> but I know his uh, Marshall Lagos and getting, still getting a spray job, which is taking forever. So let me know if you've seen the video, guys, what you think of it, what you think of Paul's channel, um, you know, where you're from, if you're from the UK. And uh, yeah, I mean, that's what we do here. Just quick chat about what's going on in the supercar community, rate the videos, just trying to get, make a platform for you guys, something fun. And uh, yeah, that's everything. So thanks very much if you've uh, watched to the end. Um, so happy you've checked out the channel and you're here and check out my other videos. So um, uh, yeah, I'll have a video for you tomorrow. I'll probably cover DD and somebody else. And uh, yeah, that's everything. Thanks very much guys for watching. Have a great day or evening wherever you are in the world. Peace out and bye.